It's Thursday, September 3rd, and I am standing on some new Chaffee County real estate. This is a delta that formed at the mouth of Bear Creek back on the last weekend of July due to heavy rains and flash flooding that came down off the Decker Fire burn scar. What is, uh, it was very disconcerting at the time, turned the river black, brought back memories of big flash floods coming off the Hayden Pass fire burn scar in past years. But the interesting thing about this one is that while there was ash in the mix, uh, what remains here is basically rock, sand, and gravel, and that formed the vast majority of the debris that came out of the drainage. It did not have a negative impact on the fishery, it just created Again, this new real estate here that I'm standing on. I'm right above Bear Creek Rapid. You can see it off in the distance there. So the whole river at this low flow has been compressed into a much narrower stretch of channel. And this is a typical situation on the Arkansas, particularly below Browns Canyon on down through Bighorn Sheep Canyon, where these uh, dry washes and small drainages periodically flash flood, whether they are the tributary to burn scar areas or not. It's just what happens with big monsoon rains in July and August. The flows today are about 275 cubic feet per second. That's pretty low water on the Arkansas and uh, does compress the uh, segments of the river that are available to us for float fishing, but it opens up a lot of water for wade fishing. So it's a bit of a trade-off. We fish at these flows from Big Bend on down to Texas Creek, really. Um, Still plenty of water to get through, but it is a lot more technical boating than we see at higher flows, of course. The fishing's been really good. If you've been following our page, you're seeing a lot of nice posts. Um, this low flow creates a slower current velocity overall, which allows fish to um, make better use, particularly brown trout, can make better use of available habitat. They can disperse from um, more congregated positions along the river and in so doing reduce uh, competition and feed more efficiently and effectively. We're putting on weight now for the spawn and the winter to come and we've got um, a few early blueing olives starting to come off. We've got some of those early fall golden stones hatching. We've got uh, our usual mixture of caddis and there's still a ton of poppers, beetles, ants, all kinds of food. So fishing's excellent right now and the fish are doing really well. September's our favorite time of year down here and uh, things are calming down after a fairly busy summer. If you'd like more information on fishing the Arkansas River, you can call us at 719-539-4223. You can visit our fly shops in Salida and Buena Vista or check out our website at arcanglers.com.